Morning everyone. So today is day three in Taipei. Uh, the plan is today we're going to wander around, um, just kind of walk around the city and take in some of the sights around Taipei, Taipei Main Station. And then after that we're heading off to Shifen uh, Old Street and then Jufen, or pardon me, Jofen, uh, Old Town which are both two of the most famous uh, tourist sites in Taipei. So let's go check it out. It's about six o'clock in the morning. I'm kind of wandering around Ximing Ding right now because I had a pretty bad headache and I needed to find a pharmacy was open. Uh, river here, Watson's is probably your best bet. Fun fact though, as, wa as I'm walking around Ximing uh, Ding, I've been hearing what sounds like bad karaoke coming from some of the, the buildings. And I looked it up, karaoke bars go all night here. So they open at 9 p.m. and they close at 8, 8 a.m. Which explains why I've been seeing a lot of drunk people playing crane games and video games outside of these places at about six o'clock in the morning. <laughs> Pretty hilarious. Welcome to Taipei Main Station, Taiwan's transit hub. Here you can purchase tickets for the high-speed trains, buses, and many metro lines spread across Taipei. This is 228 Memorial Park, a landmark in Taipei, Taiwan. This historic park commemorates the 228 incident, a tragic event in Taiwan's history. It's a solemn space filled with memorials, sculptures, and exhibits honoring the victims and reflecting on the country's journey towards democracy. Visitors can stroll through the serene gardens, pay respects at memorials, and learn about Taiwan's turbulent past. 228 Memorial Park, a place of remembrance and reflection inviting visitors to contemplate history and embrace the spirit of resilience. The 228 incident, a pivotal moment in Taiwan's history, unfolded on February 28, 1947. What began as a dispute over a cigarette vendor's rights ignited widespread protests against the ruling Kuomintang government's corruption and oppression. The government's brutal crackdown led to a dark period of martial law known as the White Terror, marked by political persecution and human rights abuses. Visitors can reach 228 Memorial Park from Taipei Main Station by walking southwest along Zongshao West Road or taking a short taxi ride. It's also a great spot to spot turtles. Shifin Waterfall is a scenic waterfall located in Pingxi District, just northwest of Taipei City. It is one of the most famous waterfalls in Taiwan and is often referred to as the Little Niagara of Taiwan due to its horseshoe shape and powerful rush of water. The waterfall is approximately 20 meters tall and 40 meters wide, making it the broadest waterfall in all of Taiwan. Visitors can enjoy the view of the waterfall from a viewing platform which offers a picturesque perspective of this natural wonder. While visiting Shifen Waterfall, you'll be presented with many food vendors offering a variety of flavors. This is Shifen Old Street, a charming enclave nestled in the heart of Taiwan's Pingxi District. This historic street embodies the rich cultural heritage of Taiwan, offering a delightful blend of traditional shops, eateries, and local crafts. Visitors can immerse themselves in the vibrant atmosphere, sample delicious street food, and explore unique souvenirs. But the highlight of Shifen Old Street is the magical experience of releasing sky lanterns, a tradition that fills the sky with colorful wishes and dreams. Nestled in the lush hills of northern Taiwan, Jofen Old Town beckons travelers with its timeless charm and captivating atmosphere. Steeped in history and nestled among misty mountains, Jofen Old Town invites visitors to wander its winding alleyways and discover hidden gems at every turn. From traditional tea houses to bustling markets, 
The streets of Jofan are alive with the echoes of centuries past. As dusk falls, the town's lantern-lit lanes evoke a sense of nostalgia and wonder, transporting visitors to a bygone era. Now, while the thought of visiting Jofen at night seems like a great opportunity to take that perfect Instagram shot, believe me, everybody else has the same idea. I would recommend if you do plan to visit Jofen to plan a day trip. That being said, Jofen Old Town is still a must see on the itinerary of any trip to Taiwan. This wraps things up for day three. If you're enjoying these vlogs, please tune in to the next video and like, comment, and subscribe. See you soon. Peace.